Assalamu alaikum viewers welcome to my channel genome wide study if you are new on my channel please subscribe and press the bell icon so you will get the notification of all the videos in this video we will do the gene structure analysis to visualize the number of exons and introns and their pattern present in the gene we will do it usually using two different tools one is online that is gene structure display server while the another one is tb tool we will do it one by one in this video so let's start first open the folder that have files related to this, this project make a subfolder name gene structure open the sequence folder copy these two files cds and genomic and paste it into that folder now we need to change the name of this transcript into transcript as well as the gene name we will do it to make the reader easy to understand for that open the excel sheet copy this transcript id and paste it in one and also in another column now change this name into hsp 70-gene1 Three and also change all the names like this way. After changing this transcript name into transcript as well as gene name, copy both columns. Then open the TB tool and also go to the sequence file folder in TB tool. Sequence toolkit ID rename and drag this CDS six close and in structure we want to save the output file in this folder. Paste your sequences write the name here in and at the end write txt and start finish in rename id finish ok then uh, again go to the sequence folder and drag the genomic sequence then also go to again into this and put in and here write the name SL HSP 70 genome dot txt and also these are contain that ID name and start finish now we will check that file so this in this file the name is changed into transcript as well as gene name and now in genome file it is also containing the transcript as well as the gene name also remember one thing that the sequence and name of the genes in these two files the cds file and the genome file must be same like here the, in one position if the gene is present like this one so in genome sequence file the same gene is present at that position 
if it is in one position one so this one is also in on position one and their name are also same there is no difference in the name gene name to do the gene structure analysis through online database if you if the name of the gene have some misspell or change then you didn't get the result so let's start the gene structure analysis through online database or online tool gene structure display server for that purpose open the browser write the gene structure display server in google open this link and here this will open this window is open so here format that we sequence format you want to use so we have the files in faster format so we change this format into oh, sorry faster faster now cds sequence so input data go to the cds file select all copy and here control v paste now here genomic sequence input data so go to genomic file control all copy and paste after putting the data in their respective box go to submit when the job is completed it will appear in this form so so you can change here the, this is the intron these are the introns these are the blue one is utrs and this one the exons so you can change here the color of intron by clicking on it so here you can choose the color of your own choice and okay here you can choose the pattern that uh, in which format the intron will appear in line or dash line string line and here you can change the line width of these intron in this way you can also change the cds that the exon color click here so there are lot of color present so you will choose any of your choice okay and here the shape of that exon that rectangular rectangular corner or wedges and here is the size like the utr or changing these options then click on read draw when you click on this read draw you will also get that new figure of exon and intron are gene structure so then you save it as svg or pdf a png in which format you want to save so png and save image as so save it in your destination folder that is download and gene structure hsp 70 gene structure gene structure display server and save open the folder and check it you can also modify it in the photoshop or in paint or 
in other software to make it much more much clear or beautiful now we will try to make the gene structure figure in tb2 so first open the tb2 open the tb2 graph bio sequence structure illustrator and visualize gene structure open it so we need the gff3 file that we have downloaded in the previous video if you want to watch that video please find its link in the video description so we have kept that sequence in our sequence folder so this was the gff file so we first we extract it right click extract here So this is this GFS3 file. Also click on right click extract here. This is our GFS3 file. Drag this file into set into GFS3 box. Close and here paste your sequences. open that uh, file excel file and copy this from script name and paste here and start here it gives the some option that we do is that the file that we have entered the gff3 it did not have the transcript name like this one it has the transcript name in this format so we will change the transcript name from this format to this format so we only write that is point 1 point i t a g 2.4 we will write this in front of every subscript name so copy paste after paste all that and make that uh, topic name according to this gff file name start again so we have got this exon intron figure here the green one is or the utr while the yellow one or the cds or coding region or exon so from this change graph setting you can change the graph width height or space around the graph then we will refresh refresh and close and save graph when you click on save graph so uh, this window appears and you can see more of to show you this these are the change graph settings and this is the save graph so you can change in any format let it be and save it into your destination folder that is present on desktop in the picture in picture 2 2 